Hi there, Year 9 students. I had a request for some help with one of the homework questions. So here it is in video form. Okay, the question goes like this. A farm had a full container of pellets to feed his chickens. He used one third of the pellets on the first day. On the second day, he used one quarter of the remaining pellets. Uh, that gave him 15 kilograms left. You have to work out what was the weight of the container in the first place. Okay, now sometimes with this kind of question, it can help you to just sketch a little diagram to help you, you know, visualize what's going on. And that's what I'm gonna do using the power of pausing the video. And just like that, it appeared. Okay, so this diagram illustrates everything that we know based on the question. So we start off with a certain weight of pellets with a full container. We take one third away from that, which leaves us with two thirds of what we started. I've called the containers A, B, and C, by the way. Um, this shows that B, if say B is the end of the first day, we have two thirds left of what we started with over here. Okay, then on the second day, we use a quarter of what's left. That means if we've taken a quarter away, we'll have three quarters of what we had to begin with on this particular day here. The other piece of information that we know is that we are left with 15 kilos worth of pellets. So that's all we need to work backwards and solve the problem. Okay, I'll type this out because my style isn't working so well today. So we know that what we have in C, which is 15 kilograms, that's the same as three quarters of what we had in B. Now, 15 is three quarters of one number. So you can, I mean, the answer might seem pretty obvious, but just to work that out, say we, we've got three quarters there. So dividing 15 by three will give us the value of one quarter, which is five kilograms. And then times in that by four will give us, well, four quarters or the actual full amount that was in there. So we know that that is 20 kilos. Cool. So now we can add that information into our B container. So B equals 20 kilos. Cool. Now using a similar, I'll draw another arrow in just for clarity. Cool. Now we've got to work out how to solve the rest of it. So we know in B here, we've got two thirds of what we had um, when we started over here in A. So we can do something quite similar to what we um, started with on the right hand side. So we know that the 20 kilos that we have in container B is equal to two thirds of what was in A. So to find one third of A, you divide two thirds by two, which will give you 10 kilos, and then multiply that by three to give you the whole amount, which is going to be uh, 30. So A equals 30 kilograms. Now, hang on, I have some less. there we go. Stylus is very unreliable today. Cool. Now we can, and that's the problem. That's the amount of uh, pellets that we started with in terms of weight. So we can put a nice big 30 kilos on there. As messy as that is. Okay, hope that helped you solve the problem. Any further questions, we will talk about it in class. Thanks a lot.